We know what you want. It's the shot no one else can get. It's the shot that the magazines and the television stations all crave. The shot that makes you stand out, and the shot that can make you money. Wouldn't it be great if you could take luck out of the equation? These are a few examples of what you can do with the HiPod. With it, celebrities have never been more accessible and never easier to catch. You can show up late or show up without press credentials and still take footage that can make you money. I want you to look at the photographers on, on ladders, one on top of the other to get the shot. At an award ceremony, you're not blocked by anybody, so you're going to get a wonderful shot. Look at all these photographers, one on top of the other. Hundreds of them. Hi, I'm Joanna Houghton, here for HighPod.com at the 78th Annual Academy Awards. It might very well surprise you to know that the clips you're watching right now were shot from across the street. By zooming in from a 31-foot elevated perspective, you can still pick up the fine detail of what's going on. Have you seen the camera down there? Don't you wish you had one of those? Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Are you, do you have sore shoulders yet? No. Not yet? Not yet. How long are you planning on staying up there? Uh, maybe 10 minutes more because of my shoulders I'm going to die soon. Do you have shoulder pads in? No, actually no, I don't have anything. So. <laughs> Next year when you come, do you think you're going to bring shoulder pads? I don't think I'm coming next year with my... This is my sister-in-law, by the way. Are you worried that your sister-in-law is going to fall over the fence any minute? I don't mind at all. <laughs> As the examples continue, you can see the flexibility the iPod has in both zooming and pivoting functions. The camera can be wherever you need it to be. You can turn it completely around and look in the opposite direction, and then turn it in front of you again. This gives you freedom to catch the action where it is. So by now you're getting an idea from these examples of exactly how powerful the HiPod is. Cameramen have relied on zoom for years, but when you add zoom to a 31-foot perspective, you have a powerful combination that is unique in the marketplace. You can see here in the shot of Beyonce how far away from her we are, and yet how close we can get in with the perspective change. Did you see this, um, the monitor on the iPod camera, where you can see right over the fence? You tell me, how else are you going to get this shot quickly? This is a great shot, even though I'm blocked by the light stand in front of me. We're right in the middle of this crowd. Check out the rotation of movement with the high point. Getting footage of events has never been easy, but now it is with the high pod. You can set up wherever you can find space. And then you don't even have to be anywhere near where the action is, not even in the same area. Cameras on the high pod allow you to either take moving video or click off still photos. This allows you more flexibility in the type of media you would like to capture at the moment. You can see that news camera cams are not even as tall as the high pod. You can't get a crane indoors to film a fashion show, but you can get a high pod in there. Use it outdoors for sports. Use it indoors again for making a music video or filming an event. There's just really no comparison. This is a shot of Martha Stewart at her trial. Notice we are not where everybody else is. We didn't have passes, we didn't have permission. But they didn't expect anybody to be on the side at 15 feet in the air. So here we're able to get the shot that no one else has got. We've got her as she is in profile, going up the stairs, right into the courthouse. I want you to notice how far away we are as well. We weren't anywhere close to the stairs. All the, all the presses across the street were on the side of the stairs at 15 feet up in the air. As we pull back, you can see how incredibly far we are and still we're able to get the shot. 
One of the major benefits of the high pod is the ability to get away from the other photographers. Not only do you get the space that you need, but you also get shots they don't get. Who wants to be in a crowd? Because of this, your shots are more unique and more valuable. Look at all these photographers, I'm one on top of the other with ladders. I'm comfortably behind them still getting the shot. I love this shot. I'm behind them, yet I'm over them. And I'm able to get this, these wonderful signatures without blocking anybody's way. I want you to look at how wonderful the movement is on this. You can use a high pod like a crane. Check out this fire. I'm right in the window. I'm shooting in that second floor window with the high pod as opposed to shooting up, which is what a normal photographer would be doing. I'm at the street light level, and now you got some depth on the events. You're above the events, so you actually can see what's going on. But you can also use the high pod in very simple events like press conferences. It can work in that capacity as well, so it's very versatile. Check out this over the head shot here of all the goodies that the, the police department just now. I was shooting at eye level here, just would not get the same sense of the size of this uh, group of cyclists. It's a real nice shot. Now I don't have to be 15 feet in the air. I can reduce the high pod to about six, seven feet, and that's what I did here. But here, it's a perfect parade camera system. I'm able to get above the floats. And the fact that I can move the high pod so easily I can move it right up to the float and not uh, uh, have trouble moving the high pod. So those are some examples of how you can use the high pod. So to summarize, that's the high pod. Your bird's eye view into any newsworthy event. Just about inside now, the red carpet is really thinning out. JLo is just one of the final stragglers to arrive, and everyone's about to go inside and take their seats. So, I'm Joanna Halton for highpod.com.